Y'all niggas got me hot. Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. As you guys seen in the last video, I just blow dried my hair. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how I trim my ends and I'm going to attempt to give myself long layers. Now, I just wanna state that I am not a hairdresser. I only do what works for my hair. And if you see something that you don't like, don't do it for your hair, okay? So, first I'm going to section my hair, the top from the bottom, because I'm going to, in the back, I'm gonna trim it straight across. That's gonna be my longest layer. Um, and I wanna get those uh, dead ends off in the back. So we're just gonna go from ear to ear. Mm -hmm. I want a little, I want a little bit more than that in the back. I don't want a whole bunch of layers, just a little bit. We got the top up and out the way. I'm going to It ain't gotta be perfect, it just gotta be somewhat even. Now in the back, I'm going to pull it all into a ponytail and um, As you can see, I have my two ponytails, one at the top, one at the bottom. And I'm just going to slide this one down a little bit. I'm not taking very much off on the back end, but now that I have that kind of in the place, I'm gonna throw this up over my shoulder. And we're cutting 
maybe about an inch and a half off the back. Boom. We're gonna take it out. Make sure it's even. and split it in half. I'm gonna bring it to the front. Hold on, let me get my other mirror. Those ends feel so much better. All right, <laughs> so we cut as much as we're gonna cut off of the back. Um, once I flat iron it, I'll see which areas need to be cleaned up. But for right now, that's the first cut. Yes, I'm happy with that. I want to move the mirror because I have a whole mess going on down here with all my products and uh, I really don't want that in the video. Alright, so this is as much as we cut off the back. It wasn't very long, wasn't very much, but it was definitely needed because my ends were so dry and damaged just from me not taking care of my hair when I was sick. All right, 
<coughs> we are going to I think I'm just gonna throw this back part into a little braid or something and get it out the way Hey boo, so the camera overheated. I let it cool down some. We're gonna go back to where we started. I'm gonna cut some layers in the front. All right, let's find our middle. Let's find our middle. Jeez. That's good enough. It ain't gotta be perfect. Now let's find the top of our head. We'll go about We're right here. How do I wanna do this? Okay, we're gonna do it like this for now. This part. Down to the ear. And it ain't gotta be perfect because we gonna straighten it. And curl it. If you mess up, it's okay. Just put a curl. <laughs> Just curl. <laughs> Let me get my other section. good enough for me. I'm going to take all of this in the third section and bring it up together. Try to get it as flat as you can, and you're going to put it in a ponytail. In the middle of your head.
All right. Now that we got a little ponytail in the middle of our head, like this, the back section we now touch him. I have a little binder. And I'm directing my hair forward. I'm gonna put this little binder in my hair this way. I'm not gonna wrap it tight because I wanna be able. <laughs> Let me get this on my face. I'm not gonna wrap the binder tight because I wanna be able to get it back out of my head. Now remember in the back, we cut off about an inch and a half. So on the sections coming up, you're gonna wanna take off more than what you took in the back so that you will have layers. So I'm gonna pull this forward. And the more you cut off, the more dramatic your layers will be. Let me see. I think I'm gonna start with like a finger's length because I don't want uh, super choppy layers. I just want enough. So I'm gonna bring this down. Measure it with my little finger here. And remember you can always take off more later. So don't, don't think you gotta go ham right now. So yeah, I'm gonna cut like this much. I can't see. Boom, you see? We cut off like that much. And we're just going to point up, 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 and cut. If I can see, Lord of mercy. Let me get this out of my face first. <laughs> we are just going for very subtle, cutesy little layers. Nothing drastic. And if my hairdresser is watching this, girl... I'm sorry. Don't judge me. And all you Brad Mondo fans out there, don't judge me either.
Oh, all right. Let's keep going. We're just trusting the process at this point. Now we have cut off uh, about this much from the middle layer. Of course, I did my top ponytail, my little unicorn ponytail. See how much we cut off from that one. So I'm gonna cut off about this much in the front. See? Just very subtle, subtle, subtle layers. And that's what we cut off in the front. Still sick. And I just want to blend this here in the front a little bit better.
Okay, before I cut any more of it, I want to flat iron it and kind of get a feel for it because right now it's like really fluffy and I know that I need to blend this a little bit better. So that's all I'm going to do for right now as far as the cut. I'm going to straighten it and then we'll even out and blend more once it's all straightened. But as you can see, I got a little bit of layer in the front um, here. And I don't know what it's looking like in the back. Let's see if I can see. My ends feel so much better, y'all. <laughs> this is what I cut from the middle section, and this is what I cut from the front. So we didn't cut very much off. It was needed though. Oh my gosh, it was needed. All right, thank you guys so much for watching this portion of the video, me cutting the hair. Now I'm going to wrap this video up and go into the next video of how I'm going to straighten my hair, bump the ends a little bit, and then I'll even out the cut if I need to. So please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next one.